Welcome back, YouTube! Can you believe it? We are trying out a new location. Games with Robbie asked me if my bird hunting spot is better than the tumbleweed cougar spawn. Okay? And I respond to that with... I haven't tried hunting the tumbleweed spawn yet. So, let me give it a go. Let me get some footage and we can make some comparisons. This is my first hunt. Okay. Well, it's actually my second hunt. I didn't record the first hunt because, as I said, I wasn't familiar with this. I hadn't. I, I was familiar with the hunt method, but I hadn't actually practiced it yet. So, I already made a run just to make sure I knew what I was doing. This is my second run. So, here we go. Without further ado, here is your new episode of Return of the Dead Eye with yours truly, The Last Dead Eye. Now, let's find this cougar. Okay, we're looking around. There it be, a three-star cougar. How about that? Isn't that glorious, people? I didn't even have to reload the game. I just came from the butcher after selling my previous cougar and I didn't even have to reload. That is truly amazing. Now, I'm sure we're not going to get a three-star every single time, and then we have to deal with the occasional person that might end up killing us, and we lose the cougar. Things like that are going to happen. When you're hunting birds, people can't steal the feathers from you. But when you're hunting birds... You know, like, it's really crowded. There's there's, there's problems with that, just like there's problems with any other hunt. If you're a low-level player, you might want to stick to bird hunting, because that's safer. Your loot goes into your satchel, and it doesn't come out until you're at the butcher. But if you can handle some PvP, this might be the place to be. All right, you see, I made twenty-one seventy-five in four minutes. That's three hundred twenty-six dollars and twenty-five cents per hour, and it's repeatable. It appears that is something you can do with quite regularity. Now, I'm not sure how frequent this is a three-star versus a one or two-star, so we're going to make some more hunts. We're going to make some more recordings. We're going to get some more averages here to try and help determine what we're pulling in on average per hour for these hunts but it's looking very promising because we're not going to have to reload at all which is pretty awesome in my book i'm looking forward to turning that posse on and just leaving it on and getting some time spent as a posse leader in order to work towards rolling that award over and earning that gold for that award so, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Hit like and share if you're so inclined. You know, your friends might want to see this. Maybe not. Maybe so. I don't know. Hey, it's up to you. That's your button to hit. So, I appreciate you watching. And I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Return of the Deadeye. Until then, you have a wonderful day and take care. Bye-bye. I suppose so. Ain't nothing special, but okay.